This is something we've been talking about a lot of numbers. They're confusing. To me, the most important numbers about this whole thing appeared in a very interesting New York Times poll of the uninsured that it came out this week, hasn't gotten enough attention. 58% of the uninsured have not even looked up information about Obamacare yet. 59% of them say that getting insurance would hurt them financially. And 54%, this is sort of the good news, say they, you know, by March they'll get it. So about half of the uninsured, reluctant, the net of this is reluctantly will go ahead and sign up. And that is what has got to be worrying the White House. And 53% oppose Obamacare. In your analogy about the hardship and the hurricane, the hurricane here and the hardship it's here a tornado. is Obamacare. Yeah. And that's what the disaster is, and that's why these people are being given a special uh, dispensation, which will ultimately have to be extended to everybody, which means after abolishing the employer mandate, administration is going to have to abolish the individual mandate, and there will be no money at all in the exchanges. The insurers are going to go south.